Hello guys, hello friends, welcome back. This is Kay Hayes for After Effects Tutorial channel and get ready on another very exciting tutorial how to create news promo motion graphics in 3ds Max then export to Element 3D in Adobe After Effects. Let's start. First go to 3ds Max, create a geosphere for the earth map. Get the segment 150 or 200 segments. Then go to modify and go to modify list and select this place. Then go to bitmap. After bitmap, go to desktop and then select the earth map like this. So there is the strength. Select the cylinder and then I want to cut this area. But how? Select the sphere, press Alt W for the full screen, press Shift a little bit, scale down, and then there is change this rate to 9. Right here, 9.5. Five, five. So now a little bit down and select the landscape and cut by the ocean or water map so before cutting select all convert both to edit poly and wait then select again the landscape and go to create compound object boolean so after boolean so now select the subtract and after subtract select the add operands when you select the add operands then click on the ocean map like this when you click the ocean map is removed and there is the landscape select again and you can change the materials change from there any kind of materials select the white and close and right click convert to edit poly then go to standard select the sphere and press F and draw press E for the rotation turn on the angle snap and rotate it 90 degree so now go to modifier and a little bit add segments so after this go to modifier press l for the latest and change the joint radius 0, 0.0 and select the struts one need more 0 0.3 like this okay it's looking good so now time to create the line go to shapes helix press all w create the helix from here here and here and go to modifier there is the height and move it down like this a little bit radius go to parameters little bit radius and then need more turns like this so and now time to create the box go to geometry create the box and go to modifier create the segments 150 150 150 and then time to parent to modifier path deform select the peg path to this path and move to path and now time to stretch like this need more stretch and need more stretch 
like this okay select the box and control the weight and control the high length like this and create more segment height weight height and length height create more and go to part deform bending twist like this and you can animate from the percent so good press R for the scale up more weight the line scale up okay time to create the 3d sphere wave but how first go to modifier select the slice and select the bottom slice let's move it down here so stopwatch go to 30 frame move it up like this play here is or you can change it remove bottom select these two frames go to 10 frame starting from 10 frame to 40 frame and now time to create another slice select another slices and remove the bottom and move down when you play it become after the first slice auto key on go to 45 frame and close by this slice play now move this first keyframe play again looking good move the 45 frame the first slice start from 10 frame to 40 frame the second slice start from the 15 frame to uh, 43 frame there is the first wave of 3d if you want to create another wave then right click press shift scale then select copy press ok and select the all keyframes play now there is select the first go to modifier press s for the shield set the shield rate 1.5 and select another one press s shield 1.5 okay and now time to export time to export to element 3d wait out animation let's export the first tutorial step without animation press ctrl a select all press shift a copy press ok right click hide this one hide selection select all and right click change to editable poly and go to file export select it to desktop select the obj exporter news globe press yes and export wait so create new project create new composition right here news promo and press enter create a new solid so create a new project create a new composition right here news promo press enter and create a new composition right here element 3d go to effects video copilot select element 3d and then select the scene set up so after this import and select from desktop the news globe press ok so after this let's texturing here zoom in 
presets, physical, the rate, open it, mm. drop here on the 3D wave glass and go to settings, select the add and select the red line, apply the red and the map must be red and the wire, the sphere, draw, the chrome, metric and go to environment select a different environment press ok and press ok so after this create a new solid for the white background press ctrl y right here background and select the color white and press ok move to down and right click create another new layer that's camera 24 millimeter or 28 Turn on the enable depth of field, press OK. Select the element 3D and go to effects, uh, sorry, go to group 1, particle look, scale up the size like this and select the camera and go to layer, camera setting, look, the aperture, control it. I want to focus the center and defocus this area, press OK and fit your composition right click create another effect that is plexus and select the title click here right here s change the title color red like this and apply the robot plexus on the title and go to Plexus panel, select the path and select the lines, select the triangles and select the noise and then go to noise, turn off the background, turn off the white background, there is the plexus, delete this solid, select the three um, the fourth layer, the S, which is using the plexus effect on this, and change the noise. So now go to Go to line, create line like this, and the point. So the line must be red. Which color? There is the sphere color like this, and the point must be white. A little bit, the big size. And um, let's create the triangulation like this there is the triangulation there is the line the second triangulation delete create the facet create the facet need more distance like this and need more noise and change the line Thickness 1.2 like this and go to facet. There is the facet like this, looking great. So change the color of the facet. Which color? Like this color. Okay, close the layer, move it on the background, turn on the background. There is, and now you can control the camera. 3D controlling the camera like this and move the camera to the right side so now select again the element 3D and uh, go to render setting the lighting and select the lighting cinema 
looking great and let's turn on the ambient occlusion need more realistic the quality 256 and select the S plexus change the noise more expansion and select the lines need more lines like this and need more thickness 1 0 0.5 and need more facet before facet let's control the triangulation the triangulation is fixed and let's control the facet like this okay guys thank you for watching there is the part one of the news 3d news promo uh, the second part how to animate this in after effects and in 3ds max don't forget like and subscribe the channel see you next time